What's good, y'all? Here we go with only I level up, me. And it's an interesting one to think about because, you know, for example, people are finally putting respect on Jinwoo's name. And that's like, you know, deserved, of course. But it feels like it's happened so quick that I don't know how, I guess, satisfying it is. And maybe that's my own bias after, you know, having, you know, watched so many characters that like, you know, develop over the span of hundreds, if not, you know, seeming thousands of episodes. Whereas Jinmu was kind of like a bit of an overnight success. But, you know, if this is just a story about like a dude who wakes up one night and decides that he wants to be the strongest, then, you know, as long as it's entertaining, which it <laughs> has been, I'm cool with that. So with that said, I, let's get, let's get into it. This has got to be the episode that gets me invested in her. Yeah, it's interesting they're all just like dealing with trauma. It's crazy because like, I feel like probably she would be easy to rag on, but she's probably like what the average person would actually be like. I would probably be her, so... Is <laughs> this a date episode? That's crazy. Feels like she didn't really do all that much. I hope he talks her out of it. She's gotta... What is the point? Give me a character arc. There's so much potential in this character. That's nerve-wracking. Inconspicuous. Oh yeah, that dude and his, like, ride-or-die secretary. Ooh, even he chokes up at an S-ray counter. Interesting. Is this his like first enemy? Like his first grudge in the in this world? Wow, that was a pretty sick one-liner. Dang, you're just telling him to like <laughs> get into witness protection practically. It's sort of interesting to think that we don't have like I don't think we have like a main antagonist, right? Like I don't think it, really any of the shows right now I'll that and you know, Freerun doesn't, One Piece doesn't, which is kind of interesting. This one I feel like is just like more of a goal oriented series. Hmm. I feel like Jin Ho is growing on him. He's so charming! <laughs> Oh, these are the undesirables. They're easier to sacrifice. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you can be like a middle schooler doing this? There's a lack of structure here. Wow, he's just... that was just a unanimous decision. Oh, so he has to do all of these raids now? Low-key? I feel like <laughs> I feel like this is not a sustainable long-term business plan. I can not read that. I'm not going back. Wow. <laughs> Seems like he just got lit for a second. Well, it'll be a surprise, whatever that did. <laughs> Jinho is the cosplayer. <laughs> oh my god. Jinho is such a ball buster for why. I like red and black more, but I think he looked better in the gold and silver. <laughs> You've got something on your head. Thinks about it. 
world and then disappear. It's only a matter of time, right, until a game comes out based on this. Ah, that's an interesting narrative decision right there, leaving it to the imagination. I would just be, if I was in this group, I would be like, what did I miss? Because I'm kind of like that now. Man, this is a sweet deal. She's definitely going in there with them, though, I'm sure. At some point. It's just music, it's so poppy. Dang. Jin Ho is getting. S Jin Wu is getting stacked. Jin Ho is getting. <laughs> oh, he was about to get packed. Like, is this song in English? Ooh, that's cool. <laughs> oh, he's so proud of himself. <laughs> Dang, what an impact. I don't so much understand the point, like, of the, not the point, but I don't under, I don't know if I would get the risk of doing something that you could only really do, like, once. It's so risky, you know? Like, what is just preventing them from walking in? Is it in the contract that they can't walk in? I mean, I guess that would make sense. But, I don't know, I feel like people be nosy for real. Is it the fire tower? That's what I'm with. Ah. Oh, he's in such a rush to help his mom. I... Such a good boy. Dang, they're ballers. They're making the black market seem real appealing. <laughs> Rich kid playing hunter. He gets so much crap and he's such a good kid. Such a good kid. I think Jin, Jin Ho is like the meg of this show. Oh man, everyone's so shady. This whole series is just filled with shady characters. <laughs> Dang, oh my gosh. <laughs> so what? So this I mean this isn't illegal, right? <laughs> hey gosh, this guy's just sprung right now. I mean clearly this is a an imp she's somewhat important. This is an interesting dynamic. Can't say they're friends, I feel like they're definitely business partners. Colleagues at best. I think are there only 12 episodes in this season? Because I was like, we're gonna need to start cooking here soon, and... The gas might be on! If you get some kind of of, of, of dream like that, whatever you were about to do that day, cancel it, please. Not, Ugh, not a reoccurring one. Man. They were like, alright, we need to we need to we need to get their attention again. <laughs> Ooh, Jeju. We're going back. He's so just standoffish. He's just not a person you want to get to know. Oh, he'd have to leave Jin Ho? Man, as a recruiter, I better start taking notes. I was just expecting an immediate no. I'm surprised he's even humoring this. Oh my gosh. 
feel like he never really planned to join in the first place. Gives him like a cat scratch, that's so... Oh wow, this is not... This is just a quick turn. It's crazy too, because he met this dude in public. Wow, this dude really shot himself in the foot. <laughs> he just goes back to casual... Ca it's just water under the bridge. It's just still someone he would want to work with. I mean, I guess. I feel like I can't even question like these characters' mindset logic or I'm just going to go crazy. I just got to accept that like, if you were in this business, you were just a nutcase. Because I <laughs> the fact is even still at this table. No. Oh, wow. Huh? It's all the hype in. I was like. It's this. Also you know, yeah, always ask for more, y'all. Man, Jin Ho is like really, he's on, he's on the come up. <laughs> Close his eyes. He didn't even know what he was gonna get. <laughs> Am I the only one that just feels like Jin Ho oh, Jin Mo is just not a very likable person? You know what? Maybe that's why we have Jin Ho. We need the balance. All these numbers just really just don't mean anything to me. I mean, million is, I mean, billion and billion. I, I get it's big. It's a lot. It's <laughs> <laughs> scam. Okay, well, that confirms that Jin Ho is just, Jin Wu is just not supposed to be a likable character. Dang, that's some pretty masterful planning, though. He's like a celebrity. Wow. Jin Wu's ability to just baitify everyone. Well, that was an interesting one for sure. I think that they were aware of the fact of how like dialogue-y and like exposition heavy this and number numerical this episode was, and so we got little like snips and pieces of like that really visual sort of like fantasy dream sequence that happened, or the quick little like montages, we quick like two minute montage of that we got of Jin Wu hopping around through, through the dungeons, and but besides that, like it was pretty. Like, just to, I feel like just to really give us a good picture of who Jin Wu is. And I'm not so much interested in, like, at, at this point of the little, like, trades and deals and business partnerships that he's, like, curating. But I will say that, like, I'm interested. Like, I hope it goes somewhere. Like, I just hope it, I just hope it delivers, you know, of course. Like, it's interesting to think that Jin Wu is in a position where he could, like, very much become someone powerful. Like, he, he could become a powerful figure in the hunter role. And that's just... For being, you know, that's just by lifting, you know? So hit the gym, y'all. But, yeah, besides that, I feel like it seems like there's just these, these little tiny seeds that are still being planted, which is fascinating, such as, like, the hoodie girl whose name I've already forgotten. I was really hoping that, like, if they, if, I mean, if they're trying to, like, you know, just make it be a slow burn and have her, inter like, have her slowly, you know, grab her interest, that's fine. But there is nothing really there that I feel like that was like, oh, like, what what is this character about? She, she, she's a kid. But she doesn't want to be. I guess that's about it. But other than that, yeah, there's a really good like yin yang thing going on with Jin Wu and Jin Ho. That I'm so glad that Jin Ho is in this series, or else I feel like Jin Wu would just be too unlikable for me to like take <laughs> for too long at a time. Um, but yeah, other than that, hopefully the next episode is a little bit more exciting. So until then.